Causes of Soil Pollution The major causes of soil pollution are water and air pollution, chemical waste from factories and pesticides. The most common type of soil contamination is due to the use of fertilizers or chemicals in agricultural production, such as fertilizer runoff that releases nitrates and other nutrients into surface waters or groundwater. Soil pollution is caused by aerosol. It is important to know that the soil can be polluted by aerosol, which will cause many problems for nature. Aerosols are waste particles from fossil fuels and other sources like industrial processes or car exhausts. These fine droplets of liquid chemicals in fog form a haze when they come into contact with sunlight, this makes them difficult to see through but also prevents some light rays from reaching the Earth's surface altogether on hazy days, affecting our photosynthesis process and adding more CO2 concentration in Earth atmosphere since plants cannot absorb it all as well. Soil pollution is caused by acid rain. The soil that used to provide the basis for natural ecosystems is now tainted with pollution. The presence of acid rain in our atmosphere can disrupt this delicate balance as it dissolves into groundwater and spreads, contaminating an area's flora. Rising pollution levels have been a major concern for decades, with acid rains playing a significant role in damaging our soils. This is bad news as agriculture provides over 80% of global human calorie intake. If this trend continues, then we may see an unprecedented level of starvation on Earth which would lead to many deaths due to malnutrition or hunger-related illnesses such as cholera. Soil pollution caused by agriculture. Soil pollution is a consequence of agriculture. The plowing process loosens the soil, and it becomes more susceptible to being washed away by rain runoff or blown in the wind towards rivers, lakes, and streams as dust particles that can be harmful to both humans and animals when ingested. Some farmers use chemical-based fertilizer, which leaches into groundwater sources. Another significant cause of water contamination from agricultural activity occurs through manure spreading on fields. This prevents natural decay processes within the topsoil necessary for healthy plant growth below ground level, meaning nutrients are locked up instead of made available naturally over time where needed most. Causes of Soil Pollution Soil Pollution Caused by Construction Scientists are now discovering that soil pollution caused by construction can have a negative effect on biodiversity. New construction in the city has upset many of our natural resources. Now, soiled soil is common, and we have a hard time figuring out what to do with it. Scientists recently discovered the effects of soil contamination in an area where there is heavy deforestation and, consequently, high levels of industrialization. The study found just how detrimental this kind of activity can be to ecosystems when it comes to preserving life diversity for many plant species as well as animals who live off these plants scientists estimate that 20% fewer wildlife lives in contaminated areas than those with cleaner soils. Soil pollution caused by industries. They say that the industrial revolution was great for society. What they don't mention is all of the pollution it caused. Pollution from industries has been poisoning our soil and running off into local water sources, making some areas unfit to live in due to high levels of lead or mercury contamination. As if we didn't have enough problems already with smog-filled air hurting people's lungs, now there are places where you can barely breathe outside because your own land isn't safe anymore. Soil pollution can be happening without you realizing it. Industrial factories have found a way to dispose of their waste by dumping them in landfills or into the ocean. The sewage from these industries is being dumped as well and, in turn, is contaminating the soil with disease-causing bacteria like E. coli that was not there before this process began. Soil Pollution Caused by Deforestation The soil is polluted because of deforestation. This type of pollution has a long-lasting effect and will impact the health and well-being of those who are living in that environment, as well as future generations to come. The ground was once covered with plenty of trees providing nutrients to the roots below them when they were alive, but now there's nothing left except plywood scraps covering up grass less dirt where all animals can do is hide from danger or die, trying their best not to be eaten by predators like coyotes hunting nearby. We are all aware of the environmental issues that come to light when we hear about forest deforestation, and now soil pollution has been found as a result. It seems like there is no end in sight for these problems, which means more generations will have to deal with this issue until something significant changes. Forests help reduce erosion by acting as barriers against wind-blown sand or silt, see below. The trees also stop landslides from happening because they keep rainwater away from steep slopes, so it doesn't create mudslides down hills. Soil pollution caused by plastic. Soil pollution is a huge problem and the fact that plastic poses such a threat to it makes things even worse. In many parts of the world, 
including India's western state Maharashtra and China's Guangdong province, for example, the soil has been contaminated by plastic stumped in landfills or in rivers. Plastic is a synthetic material used in the manufacturing of many items. However, it's not recyclable and has been found to pollute soil because its resistant nature makes it difficult for microorganisms to break down as they would other materials like paper or cotton. Plastic bags are often used as carriers for other items without much thought given to what will happen if they end up being blown into streams or thrown away improperly, so we must do everything possible not only to stop using them but also reduce their use were it all possible because no matter how hard you try there'll always be some leftover which could potentially go unnoticed until people start noticing polluted soils. In order to save our planet for future generations we need to reduce the causes of soil pollution. Soil pollution caused by nature. Nature can often cause major problems with soil pollution. It's a problem that needs to be addressed, not ignored or left alone for future generations to deal with it as they go through the repercussions of today's decisions and actions. The earth is our home, but we are ruining it by allowing nature to take its course without trying to change anything about what happens on this planet now before things become irreversible. Nature has many sources of soil pollution. One is from erosion or when the Earth's surface becomes so soft that it can be easily moved by moving water and wind. Nature causes a lot of soil contamination because there are natural processes that cause this to happen, like erosion where dirt starts getting washed away due to rainwater and air currents, as well as through exposure such as volcanoes erupting too much ash into the atmosphere turning plants brown with dust in their leaves leaving them unable to grow properly. Causes of soil pollution are important to know so that we can control them. Soil pollution due to urbanization. The city is turning into a wasteland, literally. The vast majority of urbanization doesn't take place on empty land but instead in previously pristine spaces like forests and oceans. This leads to the loss of biodiversity as well as soil pollution due to sewage runoff from homes built too close together for natural drainage systems to work properly. Pollution in the soil is one of many side effects of urbanization. Urban development has led to a loss of natural habitats, which can lead to negative environmental impacts such as increased air pollution and climate change. The increase in population density brings more people into close contact with nature's precious resources leading them to be used up faster than they would have been if there were fewer people or less use for these same resources among those that live nearby it. Causes of soil pollution are hard to understand but we all need to work together to control these causes. Soil pollution due to population Due to the ever-growing population, those living in urban areas are at an increased risk for soil pollution. Pollution from cars and factories can be carried by rain or wind into rural farmlands, where it seeps down through the ground, eventually contaminating water sources like wells that people rely on for drinking water. The spread of polluted groundwater is one of the many risks associated with having a large number of humans residing near each other in cities. Certain pollutants such as heavy metals may find their way into our food supply if they have leached away valuable nutrients while traveling underground over long distances before being pumped out by farmers nearby.